Hey, today we talk about things that can go wrong with current AI designs being used to connect with external clients. Cursor, a developer-focused AI tool for writing and debugging code, is facing backlash after its AI-powered support chatbot invented a completely false company policy, leaving users frustrated and confused. The chatbot, which uses large language models, LLMs, like OpenAIs, responded to a customer query by confidently stating a made-up policy that restricted access to features. The claim had no basis in reality. It wasn't a misunderstood guideline. It was fabricated on the spot. Cursor's co-founder, Amelia Wattenberger, acknowledged the issue, clarifying that the response came from the AI, not a human. She explained that while the AI is meant to help reduce support load, it's not meant to operate independently on matters requiring factual precision. This wasn't a hallucination in the whimsical sense some vendors still use. What happened was a predictable failure of a transformer model generating statistically likely language without fact-checking capabilities. These systems don't know anything. They generate patterns based on training data, and when something is missing or ambiguous, they fill in the blanks with plausible-sounding nonsense. And that's the real risk. It's not a bug in the usual sense. It's a design trade-off. It's cheaper to retrain or fine-tune the model than to debug its reasoning, so companies roll out these systems into customer-facing roles where trust and precision actually matter. The cursor incident highlights a growing concern with AI in support roles. If the model sounds confident, users assume it's correct, even when it's making things up. Without safeguards, escalation logic, or validation layers, AI-driven support can do more harm than good. Thank you for watching.